morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world. Whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers. My name is Didi. Sunday morning, beautiful Sunday morning, the sun is shining, and I'm uh, accepting some visitors today. So I will make a very short TA update on Bitcoin as I see something really cool on the charts. Let's quickly jump into it over there. <laughs> First chart, yes, directly zooming out. This is the day chart. I'm not going to freak out on the minute chart because it's Sunday. It's a day chart. On the day chart, we can see this green line over there. That's 45,800 level. That is the resistance level. We can even put it a little bit down more like this. That is the resistance level. You can see we tried to break it over there. We tried to break it over there. And we are going to try to break it over here again. The moment we break that break that level, um, we can get a little bit more bullish and the target will be the 50k again. So we first need to break that level. RSI looking good, Bam Bam indicator looking good, the margin call also looking positive. So we are looking positive to break this one because if we look at the weekly, I told you already weeks ago, if not like months ago, guys, there is a long flag coming. And when that long flag is coming, then we need to take that long. I told you um, to buy Bitcoin just to, uh, to caress my ego. I told you to buy Bitcoin over there when the long flag was. I told you to sell it over there when the short flag was. I told you to buy it back over here when the long flag was. And I told you to sell it over there when the short flag was there. And then I told you during this dip, when we get this green flag, that is the moment you should be buying Bitcoin back. And I'm saying I told you, but of course I didn't tell you. It is the bam bam indicator that told you that you can get on the bitcoinfamily.com. It told you already to buy Bitcoin over there. Um, that would really be a really cool buy and you would be a profit of, of course. But last week I've been telling you we need to close that candle above the yellow stepping line and preferably also above that green, uh, that red line. If we close it above that yellow stepping line in 16 hours and 11 minutes, that's bullish as fuck. If we close it above that red line, that's bullish, bullish, bullish as fuck, fuck, fuck. Because if you looked at the previous time it happened, the green candle closed above the yellow stepping line and then the next candle above that red line, you can see over here in the left circle, that was the movement all the way from uh, 45 to 60k again, 15k move. We are now closing that candle above the other stepping line. Are we going to close again above that um, red line? And is then the yellow stepping line also going to cross that red line? That is bullish, bullish, bullish. And that will lead, in my opinion, to this new all-time high around 70k. Nice. Now, <coughs> the BAM indicator, of course, is the paid indicator, but you can find it on the BitcoinFab.com. A free indicator is this one, the GT GAR. We will give this one to for free to you if you go to the bitcoinfamily.com and walk through five steps. Is this indicator working? Yes, it is. Look here. The follow-up yellow and orange candle is always a sell moment. So this was a perfect sell moment. You would have sold at 42 and you would be buying back around these areas over here. 41, that's a 1k profit. Here again, this is a triple confirmation. The green, the amber and the red candle, beautiful sell moment. This is a beautiful buy moment amber and red good buy moment check um, if you want to know more about this one then go also to the bitcoinfamily.com and um, that one is over here and on the bitcoinfamily.com oh my god how often did i say the bitcoinfamily.com today i think it's a good promotion um, you will find the bitcoin family pro bot that gives you four percent a month on average you will be can become a liquidity provider you get a lot of this advantages because of that and you can find all the indicator packages and you can find the G gt car and if you want to get that one for free just take these five steps very simple now let's quickly jump into some other really cool charts over bam here now this is the first one um oh, okay let's put my face over there uh, check this is the bitcoin liquid supply shock uh, shock oscillator really cool pretty fancy words but uh, just look at the chart and the colors and the circles every time when we get into this green circle the market has like bottom out or has reset it or is ready to go and to run again you can see that over here here again green circle and after that the market starts to move up then we get a small dump and then we get a green circle and then the market goes up really cool isn't it and then here again bam there we are the market saw a dump 
that was the green circle we are slowly going up and you can see the market going up so in my opinion also really cool um, chart that shows us yes we are turning around now this one posted by plan b i think yesterday on twitter um yeah i was yesterday on twitter he's saying third time a charm how do you say it but let, let's we try to go to an mine the first time we tried the second time and now we are going to try the third time and then that would maybe be in line with this one over here then a little bit later there and then again a little bit later here so this one should be going up like this and then we have another blow of top but maybe we will won't have a blow of top and we will have this continuous lengthening super bull cycle nobody knows but that's an option as well but if we would do what we did in the last couple of runs we should be somewhere in between these two lines at the blow off top cool isn't it something more cool <clears throat> over here this is the bitcoin mining i um, just want to remind you that bitcoin is unstoppable and why is it unstoppable because look this yellow thing in 2019, we saw that uh, China had uh, more than 75% um, of the hashing power in Bitcoin. They were the biggest miners in Bitcoin. Nowadays, China, of course, banned Bitcoin mining is zero over there. And it was fairly distributed across many other countries. You can see now um, that Russia, United States, Malaysia, Iran, Kazakhstan, Canada, Germany and Ireland now are the bigger miners and it's more equally divided than it was in 2019. This is also what we call decentralization. The power of hashing, the hashing power is now divided on multiple countries instead of just China. I think this is very positive. And I do understand also the power of Bitcoin when it comes to these situations like wars or like freezing bank accounts in Canada. Because these are the moments that these countries will understand the power of Bitcoin. The red part is Russia. And if you read the news, then that was the biggest news, I think, of this week when it comes to Bitcoin and a practical uh, situation is that Russia is now considering selling its oil and gas for Bitcoin as sanctions from the intensify from the West. So B Russia is now just accepting Bitcoin for the payment of their oil of gas. That is very important news guys because this means <laughs> that they don't accept dollars anymore but they start to accept bitcoins so what do you think that that would mean for the market you know really uh, positive news not the war of course and not what is happening over there but it's positive that um, bitcoin is becoming one of the biggest tools when it comes uh, in these wars and um, i already told this mckenzie sigalas i think 2020 the bitcoin would be the more, most important tool um, in the next war um, and now sadly it's becoming the truth but guys not talking about war let's talk a little bit more about the positive parts bam over here this one i know it's not a sharp sharp image but it's a very important image because um, you need to understand that this is exactly what bitcoin is doing in the bigger scale the moment Bitcoin is leaving that threat plank or however you call it, maybe other people will follow as well. You should be this guy with this yellow Bitcoin jacket. You should turn your back to these governments, these centralized organizations, these central banks and, and turn your back and make a difference. If you start to make a difference, the others might follow. And if the other might follow, they will crash, crash really hard. And that's exactly why Bitcoin was invented and it doesn't need to be uh, they don't need to be harmed <laughs> maybe they can crash softly uh, but bitcoin is a very beautiful peaceful revolution and we should take the power back to the people i hope you really enjoyed today's video if you did enjoy today's video give it a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell, and leave a comment what do you think about the charts what do you think about the drawings what do you think about the news thank you wish you an amazing sunday and uh, see you tomorrow again bam